back at the alma mater. They got a pretty special quarterback right now. And all I hear about Sam Darnold, Carson, is that he's a uh, a more mobile Carson Palmer. Do you take that as a compliment or a hold on a second type comment? No, I've never been known to be very mobile. Okay. Um, so I'm going to go and I'm, I'm going to take it as a compliment. Mm-hmm. Uh, but yeah, I mean, the FC's in great hands uh, with, with Lynn Swan as the athletic director. Coach Helton's done a phenomenal job. Um, they keep getting these top three, four, five, six recruiting classes. Um, great young quarterback. I'm really excited. I kind of feel like we're kind of out of all the sanctions and, and uh, all the restrictions with scholarships, and we're finally in a position uh, to compete for, you know, getting getting in this tournament and, and trying to win a national championship. It's been a rough, you know, dec- you know, half decade or whatever it's been since all the sanctions, and it kind of finally feels like we've gotten out of that and, and that, that dark cloud's not hanging over our heads anymore. And obviously with the Rose Bowl win, um, it, it looks to be that that's the case. Well, a kid's pretty special, it looks like. Have you reached out to him? Have you spoken to him? Any relationship at all with Sam Darnold? I don't know him. I don't know him. Okay. Uh, I'm sure at some point, hopefully, I'll get a chance to work out and throw with him back in back in Los Angeles over the off season. But um, I mean, he he's just he's a gamer. He just when you watch him play, you know, there's so many plays that break down, and all of a sudden he fires a ball to a crossing route or um, finds a way to get out of a sack and, and keeps his eyes downfield, throws a touchdown pass. I mean, he just he's just a natural gamer, and and uh, guys like that only get better with repetition. Obviously, he's he's kind of new on the scene and doesn't have a ton of experience uh, but for him to come on the scene that quickly and and have the success he's had I'm really excited to see the the future that he's going to have the Rich Eisen show weekdays at noon eastern on audience